Assalamualaikum. Hi, I'm Uncle Asni. Today, I would like to teach you how to connect your Arduino board, okay, to your Chromebook, okay. You have to use a software called M-Block. Okay, how to do this? Okay, right. First of all, you must make sure that you are logged in into your own account. What that means? Can you see this time button? You can see this time at the lower hand, right hand corner of your Chromebook. You just press this thing. And you can see on this icon, when you hover your mouse on this icon, you can see whether you are logged in into your account or not. Okay, you can see it in this example, this Chromebook is not in into Soleha's account. If not, you have to sign out and sign in again as your accounts. You have to key in your email and your password. Okay. For example, you have, if you are logged in into the guest account, you have to log out from guest and sign in again using your own account. That's the important thing that you have to do. Okay. Okay. Now, how to do the next thing? Can you see this launcher button is being located is located on the lower hand lower left hand corner of your Chromebooks. You have to press this round button and uh, press this up button. And from this you can see a lot of install programs in your Chromebook. Okay, one of it is Mblock. It's over here. You can simply press on this M block button. Okay. So it may take some time to so make sure your internet is very fast. It seems that we need to enable flash. Okay, don't worry. What you need to do is, can you see this button? Can you see this flash was blocked on this space? Can you see this red X button? Okay, you have to press this thing and press manage and you must slide this button to your to your right okay make sure this things turn into blue okay, just drag this thing okay now it's okay it's it's in blue okay make sure you are setting it as us first okay and then you can press this x button all right and then you have to press this enable flash okay and uh, there's another pop-up dialog box that is uh, is shown you have to allow also and you just hang on it's going to be loading okay alhamdulillah is being loaded now okay once you are in this m block screen what do you have to do next okay don't worry okay first you have to make sure you are choosing arduino box okay what you have to do is you have to go over here and you can see this down button down arrow and uh, you have a lot of bots over here you have to choose arduino uno so you can you have to choose Arduino Uno and make sure Arduino Uno appear here because we are using we are using this Arduino Uno bot. Okay, you can see this Arduino Uno bot. Okay, so make sure this thing is Arduino Uno. After that, we must make sure you have this USB cable. It's a normal cable. Okay, and the thing is you have to connect this thing to your USB port of your Chromebook. Okay. Press this thing. Okay. You have to press it carefully into your USB port. And after that, you have to press connect. Press connect. And make sure you choose this USB. Okay. USB. And press connect once again. And you are connected. Can you see it's in green in color? So your Uno board is, is being connected and is being lighted up. Okay, cool. Okay, the next thing is 
how to use these blocks okay how to use it and to control to outlook programs to use to program this Arduino board okay the first thing is there's a lot of board over here the one that interests me is in these robots okay okay we have all these Arduino programs and all that so we are going to control LED we are going to control LED you see you know what's an LED LED is a small light just like this you can see this LED light is a light okay set digital pin 9 as high and I want to I want you to change this pin 9 into pin 13 okay pin 13 you know what's pin 13 of digital on this Arduino board if you look into my videos last time we have learned about the digital IO digital input input output connectors okay you can see it from here okay you can see uh, one of the pin is pin 13 okay so pin 13 is basically uh, is we are going to control the in built-in LED okay built-in LED because every Arduino board have their own LED on this board itself so pin 30 is connected to the built-in LED okay actually we can use other things other LED also but in this meantime in the meantime so we are going to use pin digital pin 30 13 digital connectors in order to control the built-in LED so what it means by high high is we are sending signal to this digital pin of 13 we are seeing sending signals that means we are going to light up the LED okay so the next thing we go into this control and we wait for one second okay and we go into robots again and you can see this set digital, digital pin 9 output as high again we just drag another one over here okay and then after this you have to set this thing as low and make sure you change this pin into pin 30 so what it means that we are instructing the UNO to turn off the LED because this is low okay the thing that is connected to pin 13 or the inbuilt LED will be turned off by using this low instruction okay and after this we are going to control this thing and repeat this thing times time we still remember this this is a loop so we are going to repeat this on wait for one second off and then we go to the other one we, we go to the next one the second time high low high low 10 times that means the LED will be turning on and off 10 times okay let's see what is going to happen okay the thing is we need to have something that trigger this thing okay so I'm going to use this event okay I'm going to drag this when click button and put it on top of this so what what I'm going to do is when I click this green flag this thing will happen so this thing is it's a trigger some sort of a switch to make this thing happen so let's see what happens all right okay i'm going to press this thing okay i'm going to press this green button green flag can you see the led it's quite dim but it's going to blink on and off 10 times okay see okay after 10 times it's going to stop so here you are it's your first arduino uno programs okay congratulations